Ice born. Um, yeah, it's 25%. So they increased it by 10. That's quite a bit. That has to be a big slow. Right, don't try it out. Okay, the question is, do I go full on Bork Rush? I think you always have to go Zeal now. For it to feel like good, you have to like rush Zeal. Well, I mean, with Tempo, I guess you don't have to. You know what? This time, I'm not going to go Zeal. I'm just going to go like full on Bork. Like Berserker's Bork and just go uh, Iceborn and see how it feels. But yeah, they increased Iceborne slow by 10%. They just removed the scaling on it, on like HP. But we don't build HP anyway, so. 2,900 now. God damn. Inflation. Did they increase any of the other stats on it? Because I feel like increasing the cost by that much and only making the slow better is like kind of sad. It went from 100% base 80 to 150. Oh, wait, they increased the damage on it too? Oh, wait. I think that item might be pretty good then. Again, only bad thing is that um cost a lot more. I feel like a big thing that was good about Iceborne is that it was really cheap. Oh yeah, this guy did not go tempo. He's playing on PB and went Conqueror. That would be gross. Also, the thing with this is like, we don't even care about being like not close to berserkers anymore okay so recurve bow plus dagger gives the same amount of attack speed as berserker so surely the back is just that same attack speed but more damage you just lose out on the movement speed but like do you even care about the movement speed not really that's just worth to do this <laughs> you're starting emoting yeah sir you do not have tempo i do fairly unplayable for that guy. Okay, I'm done to go Berserkers now. Okay, I think the Yasuo is sick of laning. Well, this matchup's very, very easy for me, so. Nah, dude, I love tempo with Yone. It makes the Shem so much more fun, holy. If I can land the one Dirk on him, I'm pretty sure I kill him. Haha. <laughs> I would have flashed if I needed to, but I kind of had full HP, so. Yeah, we're gonna see how this feels, by the way. Not going Zeal and see if it feels terrible. It should feel okay, though, because, like, the increased 30% attack speed you get from Tempo should make up for, like, the lack of attack speed. Otherwise. What's my Q at? 1.6. So it's a 1.6 already. Not going Zeal with like full stacks. I mean, I kind of like that. I think that just means you can like not have to go Zeal and not worry about it. Or just not go Berserkers. Oh shit, wait, I wasn't looking. Oh my god, look at my damage. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, like, as a level 6 and a level 9, but still. I feel like a new tempo kind of fucks. 1.5, we have almost full alacrity stacks. I think it'll get to 1.3 at, like, level 12, level 13. Yeah, I don't think you need Zeal. I think if you want to go, like, a Bork Iceborne build, you definitely can. Or Bork Shadebreaker is, like, fine. But I'm just going Iceborne because they buffed it. Kind of. Well, changed it. More damage, more slow, and just costs a lot more. Oh, if I had... It's okay. I did not expect Kai to just randomly beeline to mid. Oh, well, that's fine. Oh, does that mean they buff Sheen too, by the way? No. Okay, so Sheen is still 100% base AD, and then Iceborne's 150%. That's quite a big buff for damage, by the way. 50% more per proc, and it only is like 1.5 second cooldown. That definitely adds up. Oh my god, we're still not at 1. Th that is crazy. With Borg and Berserkers, we're still at 1.5% or 1.5 on Q. What? Actually doesn't kill. I'm not familiar with the damage with new tempo. Let's see. Hey, one more auto. Why this guy have double recur bow, by the way? Not really scared of anyone. I can kill anyone. 
I don't think he comes back here though. Wait. Oh. <laughs> Wait, when two Briars in the game, I actually don't know which Briar ult is which. Wait, there's another one. Okay, so this goes from 78 AD to how much? 116. That's kind of good. I think for this build, it'd be like Bork, Iceborne, Chilbo. That sounds pretty good. You can do this build if you're against like all AD or like 4 AD. That's kind of good. <laughs> Briar on Briar action. Nah, he just perma slowed. <laughs> he can't get away. Wait, did they make this circle bigger too? Because that seems like really big. I can't tell. Also, I'm thinking it's like never IE. Oh, hell no. Nah. Wait, I'm so tanky. <laughs> I'm so tanky! I forgot about Iceborne. Oh, wait, she had two whole items too, by the way. Uh, I kind of fuck with this build. If you're against AD, I think it's really good. I mean, it's always been good, obviously. But buffed Iceborne definitely feels uh, pretty good. Oh, my W doesn't go off? Should I kill Turret first? Oopsie. Oh. I got you. What is this guy doing? Dude, I actually think Iceborne Seconds is really good now. I did not know they buffed it that hard. Like, buffing the AD ratio by 50% is actually pretty fucking big, by the way. On something that's that low of a cooldown, that's pretty good. Oh, hell no. Oh, where my damage at? I'm doing no damage. Hello. I'm missing Conquer, Sag. I like Sonora to an extent. I don't think Sonora could ever like, get sad watching something. What? The 2000 ping Yasuo combo. One thing with this build is that it, see, it feels so disgustingly expensive going like, it's just every build in the game is expensive though, no? I'm quite literally going four items in a row that cost 3,000 gold. That is so much money. Get off page! Oh, hell no. <laughs> Bro, I've been versing. Oh, no! I don't think I can go back in. Oh. Maybe I should have fought with Janna, low-key. I think we both would have died, though. Nice. We are living. Wait, get- get him! <laughs> Alright, let's get out of this game. But no, I think Iceborne's really, really good, actually. The damage that they increase on it just for the more cost, I think it's worth it. I think it's really, really good if you're against all AD. I like it. I fuck with it. 